Well, proud of our team today for earning a tough, tough victory. Uh, want to just compliment Austin P. I thought they played extremely hard. They uh, have our respect. They, they played really, really hard and tough today. Um, but I thought our players played hard as well. And so proud of that. And um, we continue to improve some areas. And uh, offensively, we had some improvement today. Shot over 50% for the first time all year. And that was good. Feel like that's the kind of team we can be. Uh, and we just need to try to keep growing um, defensively and just try to keep getting better. So glad to win and looking forward to our next practice so we can try to get a little bit better. Well, we've worked extremely hard on um, our offense and our offensive skills, and so the coaches break up into you know, three areas, and each coach has a has a small group that we're working on their individual skills. And I think the players have worked on uh, worked very hard to try to get better from that perspective. And then, uh, as a team, we've just uh, tried to be intentional about taking on balance shots, about uh, our spacing, our timing our shot selection, and uh, I do feel like we're getting better at that, and uh, it's been a lot of hard work. Yes, best all year, and just proud of the team, because that was a tough, aggressive team. Austin P. they, they really um, were switching screens hard and playing extremely hard, and um, and I, I thought our players had, had some poise against what was a very aggressive defense and made the extra pass and, um, and, and were able to be tough enough to get the ball into the paint and, and finish around the basket. So that's a great development for our team, and uh, that's something we need to keep working on. Definitely. I mean, it's, it's, it's very important that we uh, are, you know, playing the play with the proper spacing, proper timing, and uh, that's something the team's working hard and practicing hard to do. Coach, you talked about the contribution you got from our bench today. It made your first start in years. Um, yeah. Game Great game for Ogechi. Uh, Tot had a migraine level headache and I, we're not sure exactly if it was a migraine or not but it was really it was a de debilitating headache um, for her today so she was um, as we all were sad she couldn't go but uh, an awesome opportunity for Ogechi and I thought she played with some great poise and and uh, some great toughness and that's what we need from her um, we need her to be a physical tough uh, interior presence for us and uh, she was that today. So really, really happy with with her stepping up and, and filling in in a uh, tough situation, losing Tot. Tot's one of our, you know, top producers. And so you lose someone like that, you you, you get concerned. And, and um, Ogechi stepped in, filled in uh, in a really, really uh, significant way today. It was real tough today, Bree. Sabrina keeps um, you know, coming out with great games and doing a good job and being very productive. And I thought she hustled a lot today to get some of those rebounds, really some tough physical rebounds today. And um, showed, showed a lot of poise out there. So real proud of her. Well, it's good today because I thought uh, Austin P. And, and we wondered when we might see that, but I thought they were really trying to check Ryan Howard today. I thought they were face guarding her. I thought they were being very aggressive. I thought they were seeing if we could uh, have uh, our players read the situation correctly. And, and I think it just shows tremendous growth on, on our part of being able to make the extra pass, being able to have poise. We shot a, a, a bunch of shots below 10 seconds on the shot clock and just kept our poise and were able to finish. So. That's tremendous growth for us. It's a positive development. Um, real proud of the team. And Austin, you came into the game 11 and 3 for game 28, 7 assists tonight. What did you see out of your team? Well, I thought when the game, I thought early in the game that, that we um, were able to um, chase them off the line a little bit. 
I, I thought our, our defense in the second half wasn't quite as, as, as sharp, and I thought we gave up a lot of open threes that, you know, thankfully for us, unfortunate for them, didn't go down. And, and I think we've got to tighten that up. They, they, uh, they are a, a, a tough team to defend, and, you know, had, had they had a better day from the line, it, it could have been trouble for us. But um, we'll, we'll take it as an opportunity to get better and to grow uh, defensively, and uh, that's what I appreciate how hard uh, Austin P played today because it really gives us an opportunity to, to grow from this game and, and work hard to get better. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I just I, I just can't tell you how impressed I was with the effort. And I, our players talked about that. We talked about it at halftime, although we had a big lead at halftime. I think it was 22 points. Um, our players knew they'd been in a battle because they, they really, really gave tremendous effort. I, I have to believe they're going to go on and have a, an outstanding season. Um, I've coached in that league before, and they've got a lot of, uh, of, of ingredients to be a very good Ohio Valley Conference team. So, um, they, they certainly came in and earned our respect today. Last one, John. Uh, Coach, you speak to you. Obviously, you've had a good game against Georgia, but there's, he also seems to be the most vocal and enthusiastic yeah. on the bench. Yeah. Does that kind of improve you have once you're trying to win this game? What does that do? She has great enthusiasm. She's uh, making sure her, her uh, lip gloss is uh, keeping, staying hydrated. Her lips are hydrated there, and she's uh, just full of energy. She's uh, Somebody told me that they – did a little video montage of her, and she was on the on the bench speaking to her energy, and she was kind of getting everything done over there. So it's it's a it's really terrific to see the her growth as just a person since she arrived on campus, and she's just grown in every way imaginable. She's taken advantage of of uh, the support that she's gotten here, and she's grown as a woman, she's grown as a student, as a player, and she is. Uh, Definitely one of the, the, the major, major factors for us emotionally, leadership-wise. I thought she did a great job leading into the uh, Austin P game. You know, we had a couple days off there at Thanksgiving, and the first practice back sometimes can be a little rocky, and she was very vocal that day and uh, doing a really good job. But um, she, she is having a lot of fun over there on the bench when she's out of the game because she just loves her teammates so much. So. Um, we are benefiting in, in so many ways and really proud. She, she had a, a, a great, great, uh, I think one of her last field goals there in the first half, she just technically did a good job that shows you how hard she's working in practice. So it's a good day for Kiki. Thanks, Thank you all. Thanks.